Hey friends, here we are in Fort Walton Beach again, taking another look at a, another property here, 224 Hudson. Uh, this is a three bedroom, two bath, located on Hudson, uh, center of Fort Walton Beach, if you would. And it is a 1,672 square foot. It's a neighborhood. Uh, hang a left right here at this stop sign. You'll hit be on Beale Parkway immediately. Of course, you can follow Hudson on around um, and head towards Mary Esther Cutoff and, and such. But let's go uh, take a look. If you'll notice the roof, it is a uh, architectural shingle, so that does have a 30-year life on it. Huge side yard uh, does have the um, fence here with a big gate, not big enough for a boat or anything to get back behind it, but plenty of room there where you could. Moving on into the house, enter in, you are in the foyer, if you will, uh, straight back, you have a kitchen. This is a split level, so you go down into a family room, or uh, could be a master, or you go up to bedrooms, kitchen, dining area, and the garage. So let's head over this direction. Nice wings coating all the way around and to separate your your uh, dining room area. If you notice, it does stop. Kitchen and your one car garage. Got some racks for storage. It does have a nice covered area here for storage as well, as well as two little cabinets back behind the door. Let's take a look out the back. Big, big backyard. Huge backyard, really nice. Uh, kind of enjoyed this backyard. Let's have a storage area, a little storage shed, if you will. Um, there is a door right there that comes out of the laundry. We'll take a look at that, the back side of the home. Again, roof looks really good. Looks like you use a paint job outside, um, but again, that's all cosmetic and it is the back of the home. But nice, quiet, large trees, a cool little fire, in-ground fire pit right over there. All right, moving back in. Again, all tile floors, smooth ceiling, so no popcorn here. Um, I see this has probably had a home inspection. Uh, these little orange dots typically mean there was something they wrote up about it. This is the kitchen, granite. Um, it's got the black stainless dishwasher, a stainless fridge, and stainless stove. But very nice cabinets, done well. I do like the colors. The colors are coming in to style. Uh, they are not soft clothes, so they're probably just redone. Turn table type cabinet in the corner. Uh, even the window has got granite, the window ledge. Double pane windows. Home is in 1962. So again, split level. So we go down into another room where you go up to bedroom. So first let's go down. This could be a master if you chose, uh, simply because of the size and you have a bathroom as well as an area for the closet. We'll look at that, but fireplace, electric, um, more for looks than anything. Bath. Stand up shower, little makeup area behind it. And this would be the laundry, and if this were the master, the closet. Your hot water heater and AC here both look great. Uh, washer and dryer. And then that's that door that I talked about that goes out. Those come with some cabinets here as well for storage. But if you wanted to turn this into a closet, you would have that additional space. We do have closet back behind the door here too. So this could definitely be a large First floor master. All right, let's walk upstairs. This front. And nice wood stairs. Here's where I see some work needs to be done. These floors, uh, although they are real wood, they are in pretty rough shape. So they would need to either be refinished or if that wasn't a desire, put carpet over top. 
at this time. The bedrooms are small. Remember, it's 1962. One of the downfalls I see is all three bedrooms that are legitimately bedrooms are on the, this floor, and there's only one bath. This bedroom here does have a doorway for the bathroom. Single vanity, tub shower combo. And one regular closet with two racks and then a, another closet for fold it. You could turn it into two closets if you need it. And then the second bedroom, or third bedroom, excuse me, um, a little bit larger, but still smaller home, or smaller bedrooms due to the age of the home that uh, 1962 would support. So again, three bedrooms up here. You could use the fourth, the room downstairs as a fourth for a master suite separated from everybody else. So if this house is a bit, just let me know. It's a great location here in Fort Walton Beach, 224 Hudson. Look forward to talking to you all soon.